Oi oi Sava Louise, welcome back to another video on the old YouTube and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can make some cool looking glitched outfits in Red Dead Online using the clothing merge glitch. First thing you want to do is head to over uh, any clothes shop on the map. Um, you can also use some general stores that offer clothes and have a wardrobe. Uh, the Rhodes General Store, for example, is what I'm going to use. You can use this Sunday, uh clothes, tailor, whatever they're called. But anyway, once you're here, you want to head inside and buy yourself ah, an outfit you would like to merge from the rolls. Now, they must be roll outfits because the glitch only works with outfits you cannot change. So, for example, if you were to equip a Bounty Hunter outfit, you won't be able to change the trousers or the coat it will be greyed out and says this item is not compatible. You can also do this with the story mode outfits that you can buy from Madame Nazar, although they aren't very cheap, bear that in mind. But once you've got the outfits, I'm going to use a collector outfit and the Javier outfit from Madame Nazar. So all you want to do is head over to the wardrobe, enter the wardrobe, go to outfits and select no outfit. You then want to return and then go down to the option called Weapon Equipment. This is 21 out of 27. So you select that one, go to Gun Belts, and switch the gun belt from one that you already own. As you can see, I have the Dead Boot gun belt on now. I do not have the Agency gun belt, so I'm going to select that one. So I've just changed it. Okay, so you're going to leave the wardrobe. And once you've left the wardrobe, simply click Pause, go to Online, and select Free Roam and click yes on this alert so you join another free roam server okay so once you've loaded into a new server simply return to the clove shop or the general stall so just run back and you want to head straight to the wardrobe so enter the shop go in the wardrobe and now what you want to do is select an outfit that you would like to merge so I'm going to use the Javier outfit, so go into outfits and select that outfit. So I've just selected mine. Now what you want to do is change the gun belt once again. So go back, go to 21 out of 27, weapon equipment, go to gun belts and change it. That's my Discord, not yours by the way. Uh, most sincere apologies. But anyway, you've changed the gun belt, you want to return out of the wardrobe. And then once you're out of the wardrobe, simply enter the wardrobe again. Once you're in the wardrobe again, you want to select the next outfit that you would like to merge. So you want to use roll outfits. So I'm going to just use any roll outfit I've got. The Wallingford. And then uh, leave the wardrobe once you've selected that outfit. And then once you've left the wardrobe, open up your player menu. And then go to online options which is at the very bottom and then hold the select button to respawn you will then die once you have died just hold the respawn button so you respawn quicker and then once you spawn in as you can see the outfit has merged so if I get into something like you should be able to see yeah I've got the funny looking poncho on top of the shirt and that as you can see it's all like ripped sort of like an old GTA glitched outfit you can do which is pretty cool really it's all about uh, trial and error with which outfits suit your liking which ones are the coolest but at the minute I think this one's the coolest purely, purely because the arms it reminds me of an old GTA uh, clothing glitch you used to be able to do but anyway with that being said that is how you obtain some glitched outfits in Red Dead Online. If you found it helpful, leave a like and subscribe for more bangers like this one. This is Spaghetti Oop signing off. Have a good one.